This clip here from JWO, JLo, I, I don't know what this guy's name is, Call of Duty, Activision, Simp, shall I say, suspected alleged cheater, has the most bullshit take. Obviously, that you're going to see why it's the most bullshit take ever, but the most ridiculous take I've ever, I, actually, I, I swear to God, this has got to be the worst, horrible, biggest lie I've ever heard from a Call of Duty streamer, ever. More so than I just happened to find a website with a best friend, Brock, CSGO link in description below type shit. Well, it's second to that. It's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. This is crazy. Um, what percentage of pig streamers do you think do cheat? Zero. Are you serious right now, bro? This much. It's only small streamers. It's not just small streamers, but I'm saying this. Like, how ridiculous is that? It's, it's, it's only small streamers that cheat. Us big guys who stand to make millions of dollars, literally, literally these guys are making millions of dollars, are definitely not going to cheat. That's like asking people like in the Olympics, like Carl Lewis, Ben Johnson, are you guys, is any Olympian here using steroids? No, man, no, we're all super clean. Why are your eyes so yellow? And why are you like twitching so much, bro? You run faster than a horse. Well, I'm just naturally athletic. Hey there, Mark McGuire, Jose Canseco. Hey, Sammy Sosa. Do you think anybody, anybody in the Major League Baseball, Barry Bonds, do you guys, are you guys using steroids? No, man, definitely not. And here's his reasoning coming up, which is like the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Life. You know the biggest streamers that you're saying? Yeah. The biggest... Sh this is our careers, right? Yeah, it's your careers. That's that makes Our sense. careers, right? Yeah, yeah, it's your careers. Our sponsors, our salaries, our businesses, our money, our brand, our name, our business, likeliness. The list goes on and on and on, right? Yeah, yeah, because like Major League Baseball players who stand to make even like 10 times, 20 times, 100 times more than any of you nerds who would call it, see yourself athletes and you look like as if you're anorexic crackheads. I'm an athlete. I couldn't lift a five pound dumbbell or run around the block without suffering a stroke. Hey, where's my G Fuel and Adderall prescription? I got to play a Call of Duty tournament. These fucking dorks. Oh yeah, yeah, that's 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 a really good answer, Einstein. People with glasses definitely aren't smart. This guy is dumber than a bag of fucking nails. Oh, why don't we cheat? Because it's our career. Yeah, okay. Hey, Barry Bonds, uh, Mark McGuire, Jose Canseco, hey, Alex Rodriguez, the entire fucking NBA probably. I was like, yeah, you, okay, let me tell you something. As a person who's played a very high level of basketball, let me tell you something, man. There's no way in hell these guys are playing 82 games a year with 40 plus minutes, 60 minutes, well, if they have overtimes, but 40 minutes, 48 minutes, 12 minute quarters, 48 minute games, 82 times a year without taking something, without losing. And wait, watch the NBA back in the old days when they used to do cocaine and bang hookers. Those dudes were skinny as hell, and also now they're all jacked out of their mind. I'm mean, telling you something here, didn't go. It's because of nutrition and data science. Oh, okay, yeah, there, buddy. Sure, oh, yeah. I didn't know lifting weight somehow changed in the last 30 years when you pick up a piece of metal. Like, yeah, Arnold Schwarzenegger, the greatest bodybuilder ever, the old school, the weightlifters, you know, they look better than they do now because now they're just super huge freaks like Ronnie Coleman because they're steroided out of their mind. Oh, I don't. Don't use steroids there. Hey, Ronnie Coleman, you use steroids? No, oh, man. Arnold, were you clean? Oh, no, I do never use steroids ever because it's my career. Dude, this, this guy is dumber, dumber than a fucking squirrel. Well, you think that that the biggest streamers, that this is their everything, this is their income, this is their everything, would risk having some wall hacks on, bro? Yes, because they've been caught. Yes, yes, because they've been caught. Yeah, they're J-Head or whatever the hell your name is, 4-I-J-W-O, J-Lo, Beta Male. I don't know what your name is. I'll tell you your name is, though. You're full of goddamn hot caca. Like, yeah, because, oh, my God, dude. Yes, I do, because they've been caught. How many guys has uh, Bad Breath, B Baby Back, Beta Male, Beeman caught? How many has Call of Shame, a.k.a. Bad Boy Beeman's Burner account caught? How many times have they been exposed? I'm not even talking about dudes who are like suspect Ignatius Zlaner and all these other people. I'm talking dudes who are like been banned from Call of Duty events who have thousands and thousands of subscribers on Twitch. They've been busted numerous times. 
Optic Skump, the red-headed ginger, greatest Call of Duty Major League gamer, I think it is. I don't know. I don't watch MLG gaming because I'm not a fucking nerd. I have a life and I could care less about a bunch of dorks being good at gaming and I'm not going to sit there and watch and cheer with a bunch of beta male fat neckbeard dorks. Sorry, not sorry for insulting a bunch of you here. The Optic Skump has sit there and said that, yeah, this these Warzone streamers are suspect, bro. Suspect. How many people do you think are cheating there, Jay? Whoa, hey, let me like, let me help out my friends here. Like, yeah, like, of course, the guy's not going to sit there and tell you because he's part of the whole that's like asking guys in jail so how many guys here are like you think committed crimes oh that guy's definitely guilty that guy's guilty that guy's guilty you're gonna get shanked in the shower this dude oh come on bro this is the dumbest shit i've ever heard in my life and not get caught and called out in tournaments they haven't called in tournaments but again the people that have been caught cheating yes oh and i'm not picking on just small streamers i'm saying the the mm, you know, most of them have been small streamers because... Oh, so because now you changed your tune. So we're not... So it's not all... It's okay, so some of the big streamers have been caught streaming cheating. Not all, but most. But most are small. But there have been... Bro, you are guilty. Uh, hook him up to the intravenous, and we're going to fry this guy. They have nothing to lose. They have absolutely nothing to lose. They get banned. Nothing to lose. What do they lose? It's not their job, their business, their sponsors, their brand. This, this, this rationale goes against every single common sense thing. Yes, but you have everything to gain. And by cheating, you're going to become popular because you guys don't have a personality. You're not Dr. Disrespect. You're not the ghost of eight. You're not an amazing MLG entertaining Tim the Tapman type dude who's fat and funny and doesn't do very well at games. You know what I'm saying? You know, you don't have a personality. The only thing you have, obviously, is a low IQ, and you suck the cod cock super awesome, and you are good at gaming. That's it. People watch you because whatever it is, I don't know, man. Kids these days, I guess, enjoy watching people good at video games, and they think it's, like, awesome. It, you can convince anybody of anything. Like, being good at a video game now is something to be proud of. Like, I mean, I guess it always has been. I guess you got the ML World Series of Games, all that kind of stuff. But those guys have been, like, super uber dorks because... Anyways, going off a random tangent, let's stay on point. This is the biggest crock of shit I've ever heard in my life. Nothing to lose. I'm saying big streamers as in P this is our careers. This is how we pay our bills. Yes, exactly. This so if you cheat, you're going to make more money because you'll be better at the game. This is how we pay our bills. Yes, exactly. That's what Barry Bonds did. They all they got billions of dollars. They got millions and millions of dollars. He signed huge contracts. Yeah, Carl Lewis set the world record. Ben Johnson. All these strip, strip, uh, sprinters, Olympic athletes, almost all of them are juiced out of their minds. Golly. Anyways, dude, what the hell? These guys are idiots. The biggest, this is the biggest crock and line of crap I've ever heard in my life. Like, dude, we don't cheat. No, the big, it's only small streamers. Well, it's, there's not all. There's a, okay, there's a few big streamers, maybe. I'm not going to say their name. But definitely, we don't cheat because this is our career. If we, if we got caught, we'd be in trouble. Yeah. Okay, 150,000 IQ common, common sense rationale here. All right, guys, stay boosted. Wear your mask. All right, take care. Thanks for watching the video of the Ghost of Eight. Last but least, the most importantly, question learn from Tilly and Shapeshifters. Suck on your tongue and bring you down. Peace out.